this day, more and more people want to become a K-pop idol. If you want of them, you come to the right place. We'll show you how to become a K-pop idol step by step. Every year the way to become a K-pop idol has been changed, especially if you're not a Korean citizen. K-pop industry around 10 years ago and now is so different. So, some tip you know before might not working. There's some new and quick way to become a K-pop idol. 10 years ago, if you become one of a K-pop stars you just a superstar in South Korean. But nowadays if you become one of a K-pop stars you are a millionaire. Congratulations! Because K-pop industry nowadays is so big, the popularity is not only in South Korea, not only in Asia, but the entire world. Everywhere you go around the world everybody know K-pop, no BTS, no Blackpink, and many more. If you are not Korean, but wanted to be a K-pop idol, please watch this video till the end because it will help you prepared and give you some knowledge to start with. Because a non-Korean K-pop idol is a lot harder than Korean K-pop idol. But it's possible, because our idol Lisa from Blackpink is a non-K-pop idol, and so do many more. K-pop industry has become worldwide, and accept almost every nationality and skin color. If you think, wait, what if I have black skin, can I be a K-pop idol? The answer is yes you can. Black skin, brown skin. It's acceptable nowadays. Because K-pop idol entertain the world, not only in Korea. The rumor is true, if you have dark skin, you might be not one of a favorite K-pop idol in Korean citizens' eyes. More than that you might get some hater. But don't forget, you have million and million fans outside Korea, because know where you go you will find the people who love what you do. So, live for that. Live for people that love you, not for the hater. Even lovely women like Blackpink has some hater. So, to not waste it any of your time. Let's going to step one. So step one, it's the best for you to start from a young age. Why do you need to start from young age? It's because before you become a K-pop idol, you need to be a K-pop trainee. More than that, to become one of a K-pop trainees, you have to get through the audition. But thousands and thousands of people around the world fly to Korean to audition every year. Some of them audition online, or some company will go to perform audition in your country. So that why you need to start from young, because to pass the audition you have to be the best, or have some specialty in your self to be the outstanding one. Many and many people trying so hard every year, so do you. But not everyone born with talent. But if you have some talent at singing and dancing, you will have a higher chance to pass when you go to an audition. But that doesn't mean untalented people can't be pass. That's why you need to start at the young age if you can go to some singing school near your hometown or city. Because trust me, there are no people who born with talent. Talent comes from practice if you see people are good at singing and dancing. It's because they practice it a lot. A lot more than you thought. So, you need to start learn how to sing or dancing properly from now on. And practice every day. Get a coach. If you don't have money to pay a coach, it's okay. There are hundreds of YouTube video online that will teach you how to dance and sing properly. Maybe start with that. Stop waste any of your time. You have to compete with million to go on the top. More than that, it will be helpful and save you a lot of time if you start to learn English at a very young age. It's okay if you don't know English, but Korean language must be need. If you don't have any Korean language school near your hometown or city, you can learn online. If you not yet graduate high school yet, you have to go to high school in Korea along as your trainee as well. Step 2. The audition. So, if you have done the step 1, you are qualifying enough to go to an audition, but do it as fast as you can. Because if you still young, 10 or 15 year old, and if didn't pass the audition, it's okay you still young and you have many more year to practice more, upgrade yourself, look what have you did wrong last time. Change it, and come to audition again. Talk about the audition, what kind of audition that you need to though, and who did the host. Any company in South Korea, such as YG, Big Hit Entertainment, SM, JYP, Cube, and many more, will open the audition every year, in South Korean and also outside South Korean. You lucky if you born in this generation. Because every year, more and more K-pop entertainment companies try to look for at least one or two non-Korean K-pop idol into the new group to debut. So, who know, might be one of you that are watching right now. Let's get back to how can you join the audition and how the audition process work. So, K-pop audition are divided to two different type. They divided to the private audition and public audition. Start with private audition. Private audition required you to submitting your application. And what do these applications ask you to do? They ask you to fill in different criteria. And all part of yourself that they want to know about you. Like your age, your name, your weight, your nationality, and maybe some personal information about you. Also, a real photo of yourself. No edited, no Photoshop whatsoever. So, the tip for you if you want to be outstanding from everyone else. It's good for you if you can join any singing school or some audition before, or get any award and competition or regarding singing and dancing. Or maybe you participate in any acting like short film in your school, TV show. More than that it will be the best if you can play some instrument anything that they would want you to include. So, if you have all of that it's like a cheat code. 
you have some experience to get start with, you likely get a higher chance than anybody else. And most big name companies like SM, YG, JYP, Core Content have this application provide in English, so it's a lot easier for non-Korean people to apply. But it's okay if they don't have it in English, because a lot of these thing was really easy to just pop it in Google Translate. Usually you will get a reply back from all of this companies within two weeks. In two weeks, it will get them enough time to go all of these applications of you. With two weeks they will contact you with email, or they might be call you if you put your phone number in your application and ask you to come to the second interview. So, congratulations, if you pass this application that mean you qualify enough to be a K-pop material. The next step they will put you in an in-person audition. They will ask you to prepare one pop song and English song in Ohio which is a Korean song. And these will give them the chance to judge your ability to singing in Korean. And it's really important if you are going to become one of a K-pop stars obviously. So that I told you before, it's good for you if you can learn Korean from a young age. They will happy to have you in their company. Talk about the dancing part. If you want to prepare dance, they ask you to bring the song in the routine. And usually they access these song or dance for only one verse. So it's better for you to just edit it out these audio clip into one verse, it will show how well prepared you are for the audition. You can prepare these songs in CD or USB, or maybe your phone, it will be easier for them to connect it your song in their sound system. So, what happened next if you pass this in-person audition? So usually if they think you are well prepared and you're ready, they will put you straight into the practicing process. For a debuting team, usually idol group are debuted like this. They have a set date to debut like this girl group or boy group. So, what happened if you pass, but you are not ready or not qualify enough to debut or didn't fit with any group? In that case they put you to be a trainee. A trainee will be lived and trained until you good enough and might be get some salary or loan from the company along the way as a trainee. It might be taking one to five year until they find group to fit with you. But some trainee is so bad or the company usually didn't have any project that fit them so they didn't get to be debuted. The second type of audition is the public audition. I'm sure this one you familiar with the most. Because the way they publicize these public audition. So how do this work? Usually public audition is held on a certain day. Because these companies are advertised so it's easy for everybody to know where it happens and when it happens. And this public audition doesn't necessarily need you to sign up or apply application previously. All you need to do is follow and wait for those companies announcement when the audition happen. After know the location you just need to show up there with a kind of a passport photo or something. And you will register on the spot. After register they will need you to write an application and wait for the line to audition. Who come first get to audition first. You need to wait until your turn, they will call you in, usually five people at the time. And there may be three or four judge are in there to judge you. Also, there are some camera around you just to see what you guy will look like in the camera compared to real life. The judge will ask you to sing about 30 second only, no need to bring any of the instrument. Because it's too many people they need to do it fast. But after sing they will put on a random song and ask you do dance freestyle. And that why I told you it's the best if you can hire a dance personal coach or just take a dancing class. If you nail that dance you will be outstanding from everyone else that doesn't prepare.